Please activate the subtitles. My name is Roger Color, and this video is going to be very quick. This is from the series of videos in which I'm just going to speak at random about any topic that pops up to my head, you know, without holding myself back, just to bring you real life English. So the objective of these videos is to bring you real life English. So I'm not going to hold myself back. I'm going to use contractions, slangs and whatever. I'm going to talk to you right now the same way I talk to my friends. OK, so I'm not going to talk to you as a teacher, but as a friend. And we are, you know, friends, I think. I hope. You know. I hope this video is quick, but, you know, for this series of videos, I don't write scripts. Uh, at this moment, for example, I'm driving to work again, so I'm sorry if you hear some noise. But, you know, <laughs> the fact is, I'm making these videos. I, I started making these videos for one reason, uh, to bring you real life English. But it was good because, you know, I haven't had time lately to really stop and make videos because I've been working like crazy. I, you know, I, I work in three different companies and these companies are in different cities. So it's really complicated. I don't have time, you know, I leave home at 5 a.m. and I just get back home at around midnight. So, yeah. But it's okay, you know, life has been hectic, but you know, I'm alive. Uh, so the only time I have to make videos is driving to work. Well, without any further ado, let's get started. So come with me, come, come with me. So I don't really know what I'm going to talk about today because, you know, I haven't thought of anything. Mm, so let me think of some things that people ask me all the time. Well, people ask me about my accent, you know, uh, a few people have noticed, not everybody, but a few people have noticed that that I change my accent depending on the video. So, yeah, I've already made videos with an American-like accent and I've made videos with an Aussie-like accent, just like three people noticed. <laughs> and, and I've made many videos with a British accent. So people ask me, why do you change your accent so much? Uh, okay, today I'm going to answer this question. <laughs> okay, let me do it. Well, I do that because I like juggling with English, you know. Uh, sometimes I want to speak with an American-like accent because I've got many friends who are American. I work with four American guys. <laughs> so sometimes I like talking like them. I don't know why, just to make fun of them, you know. I find the American accent really funny. <laughs> Uh, this this is the way I really speak. This is my natural accent, but I like you know speaking like an American person sometimes, and I like you know to play around with it. When I speak Portuguese, I do the same thing. You know, sometimes I speak Portuguese with a Carioca accent. Sometimes I speak Portuguese trying to sound like a you know Portuguese from Portugal. Uh, sometimes I talk like a person from Bahia. You know, <laughs> I like doing that. It's just fun. I have a good time doing that. Well, and when I speak Spanish, it happens as well. Sometimes I speak Spanish and I try to sound uh, Colombian. Sometimes I try to sound Mexican. Sometimes I try to sound like a Spanish person from Spain, you know. So I like doing that. It's something that I've always done. And yeah, that's why, <laughs> that's why it happens, you know. But it's not so easy to change accents. In order to speak with an American accent, I have to focus a lot and, you know, think too much before doing that. It takes time, you know. I have to warm up and start little by little, really slowly. And then after some time I can do that. But it's not at a snap of a finger. You know, it's not so easy to do that. Well, the last time I recorded while I was driving, I thought you would hear a lot of noise and stuff, but no. The recording was good, so yeah, maybe you won't hear anything, but I'm driving and the traffic is crazy today. It's funny because I'm talking to myself here and some people are looking at me. You know, when I stop at the traffic lights, people keep looking at me like as if I were crazy, you know, as if I were talking to myself. And I'm not, I'm talking to you. Another thing that people ask me all the time is why I don't make videos in Portuguese. And my answer to that is that you know, a fun fact for you, uh, I, when I started this channel, the first videos were in Portuguese. Yes, I think I was like four months posting videos in Portuguese. And after four months, I just had like seven subscribers. Nobody cared about my videos in Portuguese. <laughs> so I think I got traumatized. And, and I, I hardly ever speak Portuguese, even though I live in Brazil. 
I don't have the opportunity to do that because I work with many people who speak English. I work with, I work with American people. I work with British people. I work, and they speak English. And I work with three Brazilian people, and they speak English all the time too. So, so I hardly ever have the chance of speaking Portuguese. Only when I'm talking to my family, you know, like my mother and my sister. Uh, yeah, I speak Portuguese with them. But that's all, you know. Even with my girlfriend, I speak English. <laughs> uh, yeah, sometimes I speak Portuguese with her because I, we started just speaking Portuguese for a long time. But then I forgot completely, and I started speaking English with her, and she answered my questions in, in English as well. So we completely forgot about speaking Portuguese, and we've been doing that for a long time. So yeah, we need to speak Portuguese. I want to make videos in Portuguese, but I don't know. I don't feel like doing that on this channel. I don't know. I think this channel is dedicated to English. So yeah, I want to speak English here, only English. But I'm thinking about you know starting a new channel in which I would be more open to you know speak Portuguese and do things I like. For example, if I didn't have a channel teaching English, I'd like to have a channel playing video games because it's something that I love doing. You know. And I'm pretty good at playing video games, <laughs> so I'd like to play video games, um, you know, to do some gameplays and stuff. That would be nice. Uh, and maybe I could do that in Portuguese, but uh, I don't know. You know, it's something to think about, and it's for the future. I don't have time to. I don't have time to dedicate myself to this channel, let alone starting a new channel. So, well, this video is really random, <laughs> and I don't even know what to say anymore. But as I was talking about accent, and I've already talked about this before here on the channel, it's not something that is extremely important for you to learn. You know, you can keep your own accent forever. The most important thing is not the accent, but the pronunciation. If you pronounce the words correctly, everybody will understand you. It doesn't matter where you go. If you go to the United States, to England, to Scotland, Ireland, Wales, it doesn't matter. If you have a good pronunciation, everybody will understand you. And people really like different accents. So if you speak English with good pronunciation, but if you have a Brazilian accent, it's okay. People love it. People really like, you know, different accents. But you need to pronounce words correctly. That's the most important thing to focus on. Well, thank you very much for watching this video. Please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, like our page on Facebook, follow me on Twitter and on Instagram. Please join our group on Telegram and practice your English with voice messages and text messages. And if you sympathize with my channel, please help me by becoming a patron. Click on the first link in the description of the video and check the rewards and benefits you can get from becoming a patron. Uh, thank you very much for everything and I'll see you next class.